Hi everyone! And today I want to talk to you about the Course 3 Student Guide and the Course 3 Wilton Method for Cake Decorating Kit. So, since I showed you in my last video that I got this because I am looking forward to take the class. The day is coming closer. I'll start this week on Thursday. So, today is Monday. Hopefully I'll put this video up today. And uh, I want to actually show you what this kit brings in. Now, I did a little bit of research and watched some other videos. And from what I've seen, uh, Wilton has changed uh, a lot of the content on the kit. So being said that, I'm going to just state that this is 2015, just in case you decide to take this class next year and the box content is different, okay? So keep that in mind. So the book is basically, you know, uh, a lot of the instructions and things you got to do. I, I'm not going to go through that, but just to let you know, you need to get that in order to to make to to buy the kit. So these two are completely needed it in the course. So I already kind of like pre-opened the box, so I didn't have to have a hassle on trying to open it. All right. So this is what it brings: a bunch of stuff that we're going to go through. The, um, these are like cookie cutters, I don't know, it's a bunch of stuff. So I'm just going to take them out of the box, I guess, and then go through it by name because it's. It, I think the box tells you exactly um, the name of the content so we are more clear on what it brings and what it has or, or whatever. And uh, let's see, it makes it a little bit easier for me to go with the uh, exact names of what we have on the box. Sorry about that. Yeah, I'm moving guys a lot because I don't, I still don't have a tripod, believe it or not. So, whoa. Okay. So, let's see. We got a bunch of stuff. So, we're going to go through it. And I'll tell you what we got. We got um, five piece step saving rose cutter set, which I believe it has to be this one. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, this is this is it. This is a five piece step saving rose cutter set. Uh, you have two piece mum cutter. I guess it's this one. So, yep, that's that one. And then we have a Kala Lily cutter, which it has to be this one. I'm almost sure it's this one. And then we have a Kala Lily former. It has to be this one. This is this is the tools you need to make a Kala Lily. So those two. And then we have a dust and store dusting pouch, which is this over here, that goes in this thing. They go together like that. And then you got your um, little dust and store dusting pouch. Yeah, this is it. The other thing that we have is 9 inch fondant. I keep saying fondant, but it's I guess it's fondant roller with guy reelings, which is this one. I said before that I used to own one of these and uh, well I guess I have another one they're very handy so this is really cool so I have that and um, it brings oh just to let you know these are plastic rings and all it does is hold the size of when you're rolling right and you're rolling and you working with your fondant the fondant will stop right there it won't go way up there so yeah that's that and they and they, and they you can change them you see you can take them in you can take them out and you can put them back in like that all right so that's that then we have a decorator brush which is this one right here uh, decorator brush oh. it's just a regular nice little brush and then we have a thick modeling stick, which is this one. You know, all this stuff, guys, reminds me of 
Because I, I have a bunch of these tools and I don't have them with me. I just need to stop saying that. But anyway, these are like modeling stuff like when you do clay. It's the same stuff. And it's the same concept. If you look at it, if you know how to work with clay or polymer clay, you will definitely know how to play with fondant. So, yeah, this is a uh, thick modeling stick. A ball tool. Which is a ball tool? Oh, they, they I don't know what a ball tool is. Okay. Oh, it must be this one. It has to be this one. This is mostly to uh, help with the flowers and stuff like that. But you can use this stuff for a lot of stuff. And we have a um, baining tool, which I think is this one. And we have, um, then again, guys, I'm not a big fan of plastic tools. I rather use metal. Unfortunately, I don't have the ones with me. But I'm going to state one thing, though, because I said about, you know, polymer clay. One thing you have to be aware of, and that when you're baking and you're making cakes and stuff like that, you have to have separated sets. Don't ever, 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 ever use your baking stuff to play with your polymer clay. So, just a big note on that one, if you didn't know that. So, if you're going to be playing with polymer clay, and you're going to be baking, have your separate tools. Have separate tools for each of your crafting. So, okay. We have a three-piece round fondant cutters. Three-piece, which is this one. They're metal, which is cool. I said, Like I said, I like metal better. And then, what else we got? Thick fondant shaping foam. Which is this one right here. This is the thick one. And then we have the thin fondant shaping foam. This is this one. And then we have the straight scallop cutter. The straight scallop cutter will be this one. That's a straight scallop cutter. And yeah, you see this here? Okay, eventually when you cut the fondant you won't you won't have those lines you see it's perfectly straight so that's that and we have a uh, three small flower forming cups which are these and then we have a practice board which is this a practice board okay kind of like I don't know how you assemble this but I guess they will tell me at the course it's kind of plasticky see that's the board right there so this is what this box brings so I've just show you the content of the box and this is what you're gonna work with on the Wilton method of cake decorating course number three at your Wilton class if you take one ever so Let's put this on the side because I need a snapshot of this. Yes. So, guys, I hope you like this video. Maybe it's something that you want to consider um, because of the way uh, Wilton does cakes and stuff like that. And if you like baking, this is the way to go for a starter. I mean, if you want to, you know, take the whole classes, that's fine too. You can always find them online. Mm -hmm. You can find them with Wilton. Uh, Michael's gift classes all the time so if you're looking forward to you know um, enhance your skills I encourage you to go out there and uh, learn some more and have fun so thank you so much for watching and if you like this video please rate comment and subscribe and come back soon goodbye